Hello YouTubers. Today I'm showing that uh, I have got the service packet completed. Uh, after many toiling hours and uh, quite a bit of a scrapped metal or recycled metal material. Finally today I'm, I'm able to uh, put everything together and then uh, it's ready to be used on my pet dinosaur excavator. Yeah, the last stage I'm going to show you is the earring installation. See, this is a see the earrings is actually two uh, half inch plate. They're about half inch, and then uh, it only comes along with this about three and a half inch wide material, which is a recycled material. So what I did is I cut out a double, more than half the moon, so welded the collar on there. The collar is a thick pipe, um, steel pipe, thick steel pipe. I think it's uh, thicker than um, quarter inch. It's about three eighths, but the size is actually slightly smaller, so I have to build up, beef it up, and then uh, grind it down to uh, accommodate my uh, 40 millimeter pin. 40 millimeter is about inch and a half plus. Because it's a matrix machine, so everything in their size and bolt nuts, pins, it's in matrix. So, this is an inch and five eighths pin, I would say. So after the toiling, so there's a little bit of gusset put on there, just make sure they transfer the stress. This is the main joint to the neck. The neck actually is beefed up. You see it's actually inside curved, outside. This is a quarter inch angle iron, which is I showing on the second video. That uh, So the iron plate was set on there with the supporting plate and they welded in the back. And then uh, so far, I might going to beef up a little bit more around here. I might just run up maybe three or four string uh, beads. Just make sure it's strong enough to taking the load or the tough works. The things that hasn't shown here is I'm ordering a set of uh, three or four uh, mini excavator or mini excavator teeth assembly, which is a shank and with the teeth. And also there's a style where you can order just teeth and shank, just one unit. You weld them on there, when it's wear down, you take it off and weld another one. So I have to decide which part I'm going to install. But so far I'm going to use this on my job. But there's a job come along with a few hundred feet of trenching between the uh, 20 inches to 50 inches deep to accommodate 4 inch uh, drain and percolating pipes. So this may serve uh, very good for that so I can save a couple of loads of drain rocks and uh, backing up material. So here we go. Thank you so much YouTubers and I'll update its actually applications on my Hitachi excavator. So that will be the next video. Thank you so much. Have a very nice day.